The line between human intelligence and artificial intelligence just got a little bit blurrier today because for the first time ever, a supercomputer has managed to pass the infamous Turing test. For those of you who've never heard this term before, the Turing test, named after the British codebreaker Alan Turing, basically pits human beings against AI in a series of five minute keyboard conversations. If 30% of the human interrogators are fooled by the AI, the computer program is said to have passed the Turing test. Since the test was introduced in 1950, no program has successfully managed to pull off this feat, at least not with enough rigor. But over the weekend, a computer program posing as a 13-year-old Ukrainian boy named Eugene Gustman fooled 33% of its human judges. Although many are calling shenanigans on the researchers, claiming that it's much easier to convince people that you're a 13-year-old ESL student than a fully coherent adult. Presumably, the judges thought the fake adolescent Eugene was real when he kept telling them how gay they were for sucking at cod and how much fellatio the judge's mothers performed on Eugene the previous night. All jokes aside though, it's an interesting milestone and one small step along the very lengthy road to true artificial intelligence. What do you guys think? Time to start preparing for the robo-apocalypse or do we not have anything to worry about yet?